going live, live. Going, going live, live. Going, going live, going live. live. Hey, what's up, guys? I'm going to give a few minutes to allow some people to enter the chat here and come into the stream. But what's up, guys? How's it going, everybody? Happy Friday night. It's the weekend. And I was in the mood to play some video games. And I thought, you know what? Why don't I play some video games with you? I never ever do that. I never play video games with you guys. So this is something that fits well with my channel. It's, it's a video game based, based on a toy line, line. A toy line, line I love. love. He-Man he and the Masters of the Universe. So, what's going on, guys? I see, I see, I see, I see the, the chat kind of filling up here. So, what's, what's going, going on, everybody? Uh, what's, what's up, Brian? What's, what's up, Mark? What's, what's up, Photo Bear? 1975 Rain. How's it going, going guys? I'll do my best to kind of keep up with chat while I'm playing here. But what we've got going on is a game called He-Man Power Play School. Let me show you the box. box. This was actually, actually released, released for the Game Boy Advance, Advance. Uh, uh, back, back during, during the era of the 2003 series. Um, um, I, have I have never played, played this game, game before. before. And, I'm and I'm actually playing, playing it on the Game Cube, Cube via the Game, game Boy, Boy player. player. Uh, I've got, got it all set, set up here. here. I don't know. Can, can you guys, guys hear me? me? Okay. Um, is, is the volume okay? I'm using a brand new streaming camera. So I'm hoping that the audio is coming through okay. Um, and the other, other question, question I have, have there's, there's a lot, lot of echo. echo. Okay. okay. What's, What's going, going on, guys? Let me check, check my, my let me check, check my outputs. outputs. Let, me let me see if, see if I, I can fix, fix that for you guys. guys. Is it, is it still, still echoing, echoing really, really bad? bad? Yep, yep, I see you guys. guys. I see everybody saying that there's, there's an echo, so I'm trying, trying to fix it. Fix it. Hey, guys, hey guys, what's going, what's going on? on? Everybody, everybody joining, joining in. Still, still echoing. echoing. Well, well, let me see, let me if, see I if I can fix, fix this, this here. That's <laughs> uh, uh, my, my audio source. source. What's, what's my, my audio, audio source? source? That doesn't, that doesn't fix, fix it, does it? Does, it? does that does fix, that the, fix uh, the, uh, the echo? echo? Is it still, still echoing? echoing? I gotta I figure, gotta figure out, out why that's, that's happening. happening. So, I'll so I'll dance, dance while I'm doing it. it. I agree, I agree. Skeletor, Skeletor is definitely causing, causing the, the echo. echo. Still, still echo. echo. Da. Can you guys hear me now? Double audio. I know, I'm trying to figure out why it's picking up two audio inputs. Can you hear me now? Or did it die completely? Did I turn it off all the way? Better? The echo's gone? Oh, that's awesome. You guys can hear me okay? Better audio. Okay. All right. Okay. Good. I guess it was bringing in. I'm guessing it was bringing in the audio on both my my camera and my laptop. So next time, I'll try to have that prepared. This is my first one, guys. Give me give me a little bit of leeway. This is my first time doing the whole video game setup stream. So um, I am gonna play Masses of the Universe: Power of Gray Skull, released from. Uh, released on the Game Boy Advance is what we're doing tonight. There's a slight echo still? We might have to live with a slight echo. Why do you want me to... Pig. The real Minion Boy wants me to say pig. Uh, we're not going to talk about Star Wars The Last Jedi tonight. Sorry, guys. <laughs> I feel like that's a discuss. Well, you know what? I already recorded my feelings on that on the last episode of the Geek Easy podcast, which is my podcast. You guys should check that out. It's an audio podcast. It's not... I don't have that particular episode on YouTube yet, but if you want to hear me talk about it, 
get on iTunes or Stitcher or Google Play and look for the Geek Easy podcast because I talked about it for a long time on there. All right, okay. Meow! <laughs> for somebody that wanted me to say it. So check this out, guys. This game, what's really cool about this, this game came with an instruction manual, of course, but, uh, so I got a brand new copy here. I just opened it. There's a mini comic in here. Look at that. A mini comic from MV Creations. Shout out to my my buddy Val Staples over there. Check that out. That's pretty sweet. Cool little exclusive mini comic inside the box there. So, hey guys, what's going on? <laughs> so many people are in here and the chat's kind of flying by, so I apologize if I'm not uh, acknowledging all of your comments, especially once I start playing the game. So, uh, will you do a review on the link that just came out? I'm not sure which link just came out. Was there one that I haven't reviewed yet? There might be one I haven't reviewed yet. So maybe. <laughs> okay, all right, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and jump in and play. Hey, before I do that, look. I wanna. Can you guys hear the video game at all? The music on there. I'm not sure if that audio is coming through. Okay. So let me know. But I definitely want to show you um, this cool little intro. So I'm gonna actually reset this. So let me reset this real quick. Watch this. This cool. Well, there's the Game Boy intro. Watch the intro to the video game here. It's pretty sweet. Ready? I don't know. Hopefully you guys can hear it okay. Bump a dump bump bump. Bump a dump bump bump. Oh, look at that. Oh, snap! It actually has voiceovers from the game! How cool is that? All right, we're going to do this. I have never played this game. I have no idea how good this is going to be. Um, but I actually, I'm playing this for reasons. Reasons. We'll say research reasons. One save. I, I just opened this game out of the box. Oh, oh, wait, that's not a save. It says mission, save Grayskull. I'm an idiot. Okay, here we go. Mission one, save Grayskull. He-Man, the castle is under attack. You will have to hone your skills on this first wave of invaders before I give you our next mission. Oh, okay. The sorceress is testing me. Oh, yikes. Okay. Got that weird kind of like isometric uh, down view here. Huh. He-Man! If ten skeleton skeleton minions invade the castle, we're doomed! That was a terrible orco. Destroy the door that spawns them or they will keep coming. Oh, okay. Oh, these are like the little orco tips here. Come back to this spot to exit the area after your mission has been completed. What's this? Listen, He-Man! <laughs> Pick up crystals whenever you find them. They're the key to secret areas. Oh. Crystals, huh? All right, so what do we got here? I can jump. I can... Oh, no! Oh, cool. The skeleton minion actually looks like the slime pit monster guy. Hey, whoa! Oh, crap. <laughs> he just got into the castle. <laughs> Not you, buddy. I don't think so. Yeah. Oh, what? Okay. They get back up. Nice find, He-Man. Smash open barrels and jars when you find them. Sometimes you'll find items that help you. Other times you'll discover a baddie hiding. Oh, that's no good. All right. Oh, there's a gem over there. I gotta go get it, but I gotta get this guy first. All right. Oof. So he walks really fast left and right, but like, look at how slow he goes when you move up and down. Oh, jeez. Come on, guy. All right. What do you say there? I got. I gotta keep ten of these guys from getting in. So like, I've gotta explore this area. Oh, I can't go over here. Okay. Let's go down here. Ugh, the attack is so slow. Ugh, come on! It almost looks like they animated the action figure, doesn't it? Like, look at He-Man! He almost looks like the toy. Like, the 2002 toy. That's crazy. Alright, come on. This is just like, I'm doing the same thing over and over. Here we go. All right. Oh, it can't go that way either. It's like, just keep walking down, fight a skeleton. Walk down, fight a skeleton. Damage orbs give your attack more range and power. The effect is temporary, so use it wisely. 
Oh, look at that. I'm swinging like, swinging for the fences now. Wah! Oh, a portal. Oh, I gotta destroy the portal. Okay. Uh oh. I don't think so, bro. Gah! He's like tiny. Okay. Oh, do they get smaller when they come back, when they pop back up? I think they do. Alright, there we go. Oh, what? I did it! Now go rescue Man at Arms so that he can fix Castle Grayskull's stuck draw drawbridge. Uh, doesn't he mean jawbridge? Alright. Oh, do I go back this way now? Okay. Oh, gems! Look at all these gems! And a skull? He-Man! Skull triggers like this one open up doors and other barriers. Okay, so now I can... Oh, gosh. Now we got to do some platforming. Platforming in an isometric uh, perspective is always kind of iffy. Energy orbs like this one rescue some of your lost energy. Okay, cool. So I guess I go back now. And... Well, how do I... There's a skull on the other side over there. Okay. Look at Castle Grayskull is tiny! <laughs> what is going on here? Oh, man. Okay. So I gotta figure out how... Did I miss something over here? Can I cut this tree down? Oh, look at that! Wow! That's kind of cool. Oh, my gosh. Now I gotta try to walk across. Oh, jeez. Okay. And that'll remove the barrier. That's pretty cool. Okay. Surprise! There's a guy in that barrel. Shield orbs give you partial protection from enemy attacks. Alright. Oh, a Doom Seeker! Nice! Stay away from traps like these when they are active. You are only safe around them if you're shielding. Like right now? Can I hurt the Doom Seeker? Oh, okay, maybe that's his energy bar up above him. Oh, yeah, get out of here. You guys remember the Doom Seekers? Triclops' little uh, robots that he used in that cartoon? I always liked those. I thought those were pretty cool. Oh, jeez. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay, well, it's like you just take turn. I can't swing fast enough. Look how many times you got to push the button here and how slow his swing. Oh, gosh. They just keep coming out of that portal. i got to break that. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Come on! You can't react fast enough. Oh, this is bad. Come on, He-Man! Come on, He-Man! How many hits does this thing take? Oh, gosh. See, like, I'm at that part now where I'm, like, concentrating all hard and I'm not talking. <laughs> Look at my energy. This is... Oh, the hit detection is no good. Come on. And as soon as I kill him, another one just comes out. Ah! Is there energy or something around here somewhere? What's this? Energy shrines fully restore your energy. They can be quite handy when you're not at your peak. Yes, thank you. Now I need to wreck this thing. Yes! All right, Doom Seekers. Your time is up. It's like you gotta hit and move, stick and move, stick and move, stick and move. Have any of you ever played this before? Any of you guys play it like on the actual Game Boy Advance? Uh, this feels like one of those games that would have been really hard to actually play on the small Game Boy Advance screen. I don't know. Maybe it'd be better on the SP because it had the backlight and everything. But I feel like using a controller is very helpful on this. Oh, what's this? Damage shrines work like damage orbs, but the effect is stronger and lasts longer. They're very useful when you need... Well, that could have helped me a little bit ago. Gosh. He man needs his spinach. Sorry, guys. I'm trying to glance at the comments when I can. What's up, guys? Anybody new that's joining us? Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah. Right through some blocks there. That's, that's how He-Man works. Oh, look. 
There's a that's Hero's Graves. That's pretty awesome. That didn't become canon until Classics, but that's He-Man's gravestone or Hero's gravestone. It's pretty cool. Shield shrines work like shield orbs, but effect lasts longer. Okay, cool. So I got shield. That's good. There's a Doom Seeker over here. I should probably go find. Oh, what's this? Oh, I found Man at Arms. Defeat the Super Doom Seeker so that I can get out of here. Is that this thing? Come on! Oh my gosh. I got that shield on still though, right? That's not actually hurting me. Okay, that, that hurt me. Can't strike fast enough. Ah! Oh, but he can! It's like you just gotta figure this out. Like, you gotta... There we go. Did you get him? Yeah! There we go! I'll head back to Castle Grayskull now. Okay, so you're not in there anymore? Oh, we don't even get a man at arms like sprite. We just had like that picture on. Oh, can I use this again? Yeah. Okay. So we're going back down here. And I can leave. You have completed the mission objective. Step on this pad. This isn't so bad so far, but I have a feeling the difficulty is going to ramp up on this. Uh, cool game, what console is it? This is a Game Boy Advance game. I'm playing it on the GameCube, actually, with the Game Boy player. Never seen anybody excited to play this game. <laughs> well, first of all, I get excited easy. I mean, that's just me. But I'm playing a He-Man game for the first time, so I'm kind of like, yay, He-Man games. Uh, Man at Arms moves, moves fast. I didn't even see him, right? It's like he just popped right up and boom, there he goes. Reminds me of one of the Bionicle games, huh? Would you sell your Arkham figures? Uh, I don't have any intention of selling them right now. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I got a lot of things I got to still unpack. I haven't really set up my toys since moving in here. So we'll see what happens when I start unpacking. All right. Let's exit this mission. Let's go to the next one. What we got? Oh, I missed an enemy somewhere? But I got all the collectibles. And password is whom included in it? I am not going to remember that. Hopefully I don't die. I might need to remember that. I don't think there's game saves on this. You have 40 seconds to pick up all 50 crystals. If you can grab them all, you will get an extra life. Oh, okay. Go, go, go. Go, He-Man. He's so slow when you walk down. Is that it? Oh, there's... Okay. Oh, which way should I go? Oh, I think I went the wrong way. I should have went this way. Oh, gosh. Go, 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 go! Yeah! Orko says I did an awesome job! <laughs> I've earned an extra life. What's with Orko testing me? Here, go get all these crystals and I'll give you an extra life, He-Man! <laughs> Was this mocap of the figure, Dave asked? I said the same thing when I started playing. It looks like it's the actual action figure, doesn't it? That's obviously what they used to create the sprite. It had to have been. Listen to that beautiful music. Rescue Cringer is mission two. Cringer has disappeared. We fear that he may have been abducted by Clawful. Ooh. Does that mean I get to actually fight one of the, uh, the villains this time? How many levels is this game? I think it's like seven-ish levels. Let me actually look at the menu. I have no idea how far I'm going to play into this, honestly. Um, might be something we pick back up another time. We'll just see how it goes. I'm going to keep streaming for a little bit here. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. 13 levels. And I just beat the first one, so let's get going. Cringer is being held captive. You will have to defeat Clawful to free him. Good luck. Good luck. There's a Star Fox. There we go. Boom. Get this thing. Okay. It's like these pots are just laying around everywhere, and He-Man's just breaking them like he's Link or something. Okay. Um, apparently there's another burial site for Hero. <laughs> okay, I can't go that way yet. Oh, I guess I should destroy this thing. I was like, what is that? Oh, yeah, duh. That's where the bad guys are coming from. I like sometimes how the weapons clash. 
You notice that? Sometimes I swing at these guys and they swing their axes at the same time and it just makes the... Like, nobody gets hurt. It just makes, like, a, a noise, like, metal clanging. That's kind of cool. Oh, gosh. When they come right out, that is super not fair. I don't like how when I have the shield on, they can still stop me from swinging my sword by hitting me. That should make me totally immune. Oh, a key. And a little sword? Oh, the key opened that. Whoa, fire. Oh, I got the shield on. I should go over here. That might have been a bad idea, because now I don't have a shield on anymore. Oh, unless this is a shield up here. Okay. Let's fight this weird lady. He's like a lava version of the skeletons. He's way stronger. So I have a key. Okay, so I guess I just have to time it now. There we go. Oh, good. A Doom Seeker was in that one. Oh my gosh, stop it! <laughs> that is super not fair when they just bobble you around like that. There we go. Okay. Cruising, cruising, cruising. What's down here? Did I find a secret spot? Is this a secret spot? Oh yeah, totally. It just goes right back up here. Okay. So let's go this way. Wow! He just not always oh, knocking me off, man. I'm like stuck right there. Oh my god! Are you guys? Are you serious with this? Wow! Wow! That had to have been some sort of glitch. Cause like I, my guy, my guy was stuck. He was not moving. Enter my name. <laughs> pixel oh look at that it's like perfect space to do I was just gonna do pixel D and then I was like yeah I can put the whole thing in there so that was kind of ridiculous right was that ridiculous? Please use your Skeletor voice. <laughs> you have been defeated! Grayskull is mine! I don't think I have a very good Skeletor voice, but people want me to do that all the time. Play again. Is it going to start? Okay, well, at least it started me back where I was. So let me see if I can... wonder how many... Ugh, I should have just skipped that one this time. These Doom Seekers are not cool. I do not... I mean, I've changed my mind. I no longer like the Doom Seekers after playing this game. Uh, it is like Gauntlet. Somebody just said that it's kind of like Gauntlet, where you like you have to go and defeat like the little uh, portals where the enemies just keep popping out. Oh my gosh! Ridiculous! Come on! There we go. All right. Slime pit creature. I think it's cool that we got an action figure of that guy in the 2002 line. It's like the only, it's the only original character that got a toy in that line. I think that's cool. He's a character that has not gotten a figure in classics. I wonder if would anybody like that skeleton minion, that slime pit skeleton minion in classics? I think it might be kind of cool to get like a, a little army of them for Skeletor, right? That'd be kind of cool. All right, I'm going to focus on this. I don't like how every other hit doesn't do anything to it. The hit detection is definitely wonky in this game. Okay, come on! Get out of my way! I'm trying to break your portal. I'm trying to break your home. Does this portal just go like to Snake Mountain? Why don't I just walk in here and just go whoop Skeletor up and win? I don't understand. Oh my gosh, what is happening? Come on. Come on. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. That is what I'm talking about. All right. This way. This way. Break through here. That's a bad guy, isn't it? Is this a bad guy? Yep. Every time. Oh, am I, like, burnt? I can't do anything. Help! Help! 
Apparently when you get burned by the fire, you can't swing your sword. Alright, fire skeleton! There we go. Got a key, okay. I think I got a shield still, so I'm safe there. Alright, so I think I'm back to where I was before I died. I gotta make this jump now without that thing knocking me into... Not this time, Doomseeker! Not this time! Get off me! I hate those things. Those things are awful. Okay. Uh oh, I was going to say, how do I get over there? I can break this rock. Appar eventually. Boy, He-Man, for being the most powerful man in the universe, you take a long time to break that stuff. Oof. Alright. Oh. So. I oh, gosh. I can't attack. I can't attack. Help. Okay. I'm almost dead. Oh, I need some energy. Who's in here? Is this... That must be Cringer. I need energy, you guys! Oh, I'm just gonna get whooped up by Clawful right now. <laughs> There's Clawful! <laughs> okay, here we go. Full health. Whoop him up! It's just Clawful! Yeah, remember how stupid he talked in that series? I love the 2002 cartoon. I hated... I didn't like how Clawful was basically like Curly from the Three Stooges. Okay, so I can't hit him when he goes down in his... Oh, I gotta hit him when he turns away from me. Okay. Oh! Can't get away from him! Jeez, what's the strategy here? Seriously, what the heck is going on? Wow. Okay. It's like, okay, you gotta turn away from him to get him to come out. Then you gotta, like, swing at the same time. And then, hopefully, you can hit him in the back? There we go. Okay. Okay, I think I got this. <laughs> He's gonna take so many hits! Serious? Does it just pick right up where I already was? Get out of here. Yeah, okay. This is a really boring fight. If he hits you, there's no hitting him. Oh, jeez. Okay. Gotta get my pattern back down. There we go. Got him. Okay. Come on. I got this. Jeez. Oh! You have got to be kidding me with this. This is ridiculous. You, like, I'm not crazy, right? Like, that was awful. <laughs> Oh my gosh, somebody just says this was my dad's favorite show. Way to make me feel old. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, this is ridiculous. Yeah, another, another, yeah, it turns out, that was only the first actual boss I've seen too. I can't even imagine, this game was 13 levels. That was ridiculous. Why did I gotta put my name in again? He man, you are no match for me and my minions. <laughs> P. That's me.
Such horrible gameplay. Yeah, I agree. What is your favorite action figure? Just in general or from He-Man? It's definitely Mosquitoor from Masters of the Universe. Vintage Mosquitoor figure. Most nostalgic toy for me. I love it. That fight scene was bad. Definitely. I just... I hate that I, I gotta do this whole level over again. It looks at least... I don't know. What's the zero up here? Is that my continues? Does that mean I don't get to do this again? Or is that my score? That's probably my score. So... Oh, I, I should have just passed those things up. That other one over there is a bad guy too, right? You notice these things almost have the same attack pattern as Clawful? Look at that. Attack, swipe. Attack, swipe. Jeez. One of these was a bad guy, right? Is it the top one? Yeah, that one's got a power sword. Okay. Let's get past this guy. Get this. Oh, look at that! Yeah! Super He-Man! Let's go, let's do this. Go down here and get this. I think there was like a gem over here. Yep. Get the gem. Okay. Alright, okay, alright. We're moving. Hey, that one had a bad guy in it last time, didn't it? Are they totally random every time? Well, no, because that one at the beginning of the level always has a Doom Seeker. Okay, get the key. There we go. Wait for the fire. This is crazy. Alright. This is a dumb thing. Wait till his back is turned. Ooh, I got him there for a little bit, didn't I? Gosh! It's stupid how much damage these little things can do. Look at how much health he's taken from me! This is, this is Pixel Dan getting frustrated in a video game right here. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. So what did that give me? The, like, super... Ah, oh, Apparently I missed the jump. Alright. Yeah, I want this, I want this, I want this, I want this, okay, so now I'm gonna, Jesus, okay, can, can I go up here, okay, alright, let's go fight Clawful again, let's do this, I need, give me some good vibes here, guys, here we go, Are you serious? We're just gonna start right off with that? Okay. Ah! Why does it sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't? Sorry if I stop talking, I'm focusing on this. We're gonna make this happen, guys. I cannot let Clawful beat He-Man. That's ridiculous. What is going on? Okay, maybe I gotta walk away a little bit so he gets out of his spot, because then he walks back, and that seems to be the time to hit him. Well, you got me that time. That sucks. <laughs> I'm gonna make this happen. Oh, we're getting there. We are getting there. I feel like his, his energy looks like it doesn't move half the time. Oh, yeah, there we go. A little bit left. Come on. Come on. This fight is awful. 
this is how they're all going to be. Like, seriously? <laughs> how many times do you have to hit these guys? <laughs> this is ridiculous. I thought I might have had him there for a second. I feel like his energy bar is not even showing any. Yeah! There you go! Boom! I have the power! Mm. <laughs> oh my gosh, who's the guy you're battling? That was Clawful. I just beat him. Uh, Kevin says, I like Filmation Clawful better. I, I like the design of 2002 Clawful. I don't like the voice and the attitude they gave him. Because he was all, yeah, Skeletor. I don't know, that's a bad impression, but he was, he was dumb. Thanks, guys! Hey, thanks for the support! Yeah, I beat this guy! Bravo, He-Man! Clawful won't bother us again! Cringer is free! That's sweet. There's still bad guys down here, isn't there? Gosh darn it. I just beat Clawful, so I'm gonna beat you, Doom Seeker. I'm gonna lose to the Doom Seeker now, watch. Power Sword. Yeah! Mission complete! Oh my gosh. Uh, what's your favorite TMNT action figure? I just saw. Sorry, it went by real quick, so I didn't see who asked it. Uh, my favorite TMNT figure from the vintage line is definitely Mutagen Man, followed closely by Muck Man. Those are my two favorite figures from Turtles. Uh, Pam says, I'm your biggest fan. Oh, that is. I appreciate that. Wow, sorry, these are going by really fast, so I can't catch all of them. Uh, Doom Seekers are more powerful than Clawful. <laughs> right? They definitely scared me more than Clawful at the end there. That's crazy. Alright, so I only got six out of eight enemies. I definitely skipped some. Oh, I missed one of the collectibles. My password is have done butter. Have have done but have done better? Ooh, have done better. I have done better. Actually I haven't. This is the first time I played this game. Okay. Evergreen Sprint. Crystal flowers from the Palace of Eternia have been lost in the Evergreen Forest. Take Battle Cat and retrieve them. I get to ride Battle Cat? Awesome. I wish we could have got to see him like turn Cringer into Battle Cat after I saved him. That would have been cool. Pick up at least 20 crystal flowers to win an extra life. Avoid all obstacles. Jump over them if you can. Use your guns to defeat baddies. Oh, this is this is like the Battle Cat toy that had like mounted guns on it. It like it does look like all of the sprites in this are almost based off of the toys, which is cool. Except Clawful didn't actually have an action figure in that line. He got a neck action later, but he didn't have a figure. All right, here we go. Ready? Oh, look, there's a starting line. That's hilarious. Oh, Battle Cat runs slow. Oh yeah, that's how we jump. That's how we shoot. Oh, oh, oh! I missed that crystal. Okay. Spider! Giant spiders. Video game trope, right? When in doubt and you need a bad guy for a video game, you put a giant spider in it. Oh, I like how Battle Cat kind of roars when you jump. <clears throat> This is like really slow. I wasn't expecting. I was like ready for him to like take off and kind of be like hard to steer. And nope, it's just like really slow. I missed one crystal though. I wonder if that's bad. I just won't get an extra life probably, huh? Because I have to collect all the crystals to get an extra life. What was that? It had wings. It was like a little mini dragon. This is like just the same old thing all the way through, I guess. Come here and get that. Jump over that. It's like a little tiny griffin is what that looks like. A little griffin. That's kind of cool. Oh, almost missed that one. If we're in the Evergreen Forest, where's Moss Man? Shouldn't he be hanging out and helping me? Taking care of these big spiders or something? Why is Moss Man just letting big giant spiders run around this forest? Whoa! That's not good that I ran into that so much. I think I'm almost to the end according to that little line at the top of the screen there. Battle Cat! I don't like Battle Cat with giant guns on his back. <laughs> I think that's so silly. Personally speaking. 
I always displayed my 2002 Battle Cat toy without the guns. I took them off. They're like those big giant rocket launching guns, and I, I, I don't know. I just I like my Battle Cat without guns. Finish line. Way to go, He-Man! You found enough crystal flowers to get an extra life! Boom! You and Battle Cat are quite a team. We're best friends. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, I killed all 19 enemies. You got 24 out of 25 collectibles. I missed that one at the very beginning. This is awesome. I think the password means Valiant Effort. Look at that. I, I love that. Or Valiant Fart. Ugh. Yep, I just dropped a fart joke in my live stream. Why wouldn't I? <laughs> I need a drink. Oh. Sorry. Checking my phone. That's inappropriate. I shouldn't check my phone while I'm live streaming. How you guys doing? You guys doing good? Uh, the fan-made PC game looks so much better, says Kapow Entertainment. I know, that is something I've never actually played, um, and I want to play that. So maybe I will stream that sometime. Would you guys want to watch me stream that? Give it a try? I think I might do that sometime. I need some new toys. <laughs> we always need new toys, don't we? All right, so Beast Man lives. Did we think he didn't? Did we think he was dead? Beastman is on the trail. It's time to purge the forest of his evil presence. Oh, it's Stratos! We gotta talk like 2002 Stratos. There's a big mean spider across the river. I think he might be guarding something important. Yeah, he totally talked like Sean Connery. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh! Oh, no! <laughs> what? The spider bit me! How do you kill the spiders? Oh, this is awful. Oh, my gosh. Why does the spider have a big energy bar? Are you kidding me? That should be like a one-hit kill. Get out of here with this. Here, I got my shield on now. Come on. Unreal. Like, the, like there's too many hits required on all these baddies. The little tiny griffin bat thing. Like, every time you try to hit somebody, it does that thing where you like it, they just bounce off of you. What the heck? Come on, man. Come over here. Can I just go past? I'm just going to walk past you. I took half my health trying to fight that stupid little griffin. Oh, gosh. Ah! <laughs> that's, that's horrifying. Oh, no. This is... This is not fun. <laughs> oh, I gotta kill that thing somehow. Help! Oh, jeez. I am gonna die. Oh, I am gonna die right now. Oh! Yeah, if Clawful was hard, what will Beastman be like? You mean, what about these spiders? I can't even fight this big giant stupid spider. Look at this stupid thing. Ah! I guess I gotta get it to chase me until it gets bored. And then I sh hit it in the back. Oh no! <laughs> okay. Come chase me, spider. Ah! Gotcha. Ah! <laughs> this is a stupid strategy. But it's a word. Oh, and then the griffin gets me. Awesome. Oh my gosh. Okay, come on. Oh! Yeah! Watch out, He-Man! Giant spiders spawn spiderlings when they are destroyed. Good. Great. Good! More! More spiders! I don't like that this is like how you have to beat every enemy in the game. Look, this is how I beat Clawful, and it's the same way I have to fight the stupid spiders. Oh, and then and then I get something that I can do one-hit kills with. And I can't even hit that thing for some reason. Oh! <laughs> what? 
Come on, give me a break. All right. What's this thing? What did that do? That's all that's over here? That's the only reason I came over here? <laughs> all right, get out of here. Don't fight that guy. Just get away from him. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Screams of pain. Okay. Watch out for the pools of quicksand up ahead. They will really slow you down. All right. Okay, I can't go up there yet. Oh, good. Here we go again. I guess I have a shield on right now, so maybe I can just... Oh, I don't have a shield anymore. Run away, run away. Run away. So now I have to do this with pools of quicksand around me. I want giant spider action figure for classics. Somebody start the petition. <laughs> He's obviously the greatest foe that He-Man has faced. Excellent, He-Man. I think that spider just dropped something that you will need later. Oh, like two more spiders? I don't need those. Oh, jeez. Are you... Come on, man. Run away, He-Man. Run away from the stupid spiders. Uh, look at where the spiders like jump at you. This is this is ridiculous. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's like a little stone I gotta stand. Oh, look at that! You see that little bit? Now I have to do all of that over again. <sighs> all right, I need a, I need a break for a second. <laughs> that's this game is rough. Uh, uh, Day for Infinites. When did this game come out? This had to have been in like 2003-ish, I would think. 2004, maybe. Uh, oh, earlier than that. It's dated 2001 on the copyright, so I'm guessing 2002. Because 2002 was when the new He-Man series started, so this probably came out uh, right, at the, right at the beginning of the line. Right at the beginning of it all. Why do you feel bad, Motu Bryce? Uh, hold down attack button to build up charge attack with sword? Huh. Uh, Mahato says, did you hear the 2018 Turtles won't have their weapons anymore? I did not hear that. I hope that's not true. I'm still going to give that series a, a chance, you know. It's something new and different. And I love the most recent Turtle series, like, so much. So I, I totally know it's not going to live up to that. I'm just going to let it be its own thing, and we'll see how it goes. <laughs> Call me nuts, but this game has Angry Video Game Nerd written all over it. Either that, or a Lost from Pixels to Plastic episode. Or a Plastic from Pixels to episode. We might do this. I don't know. Um, yeah, James should totally do this game. I know that Mike uh, Matei is a big He-Man fan. He and I talk about He-Man a lot, actually. Uh, er, er, last time I saw him at uh, Retropalooza, we sat at dinner and just talked about He-Man a bunch. It was pretty cool. All right, so I'm going to try again, and I'm going to try this sword charge thing. Oh, look at that! So the game didn't tell me that at all. I'm glad I have you guys. Let's see. What did it kill?! Oh, this might make things so much easier. Although I don't know how I would have used that on, like, Clawful because there was so much uh, attacking and everything. Okay. I can still walk while I'm charging, so that's actually really cool. This guy keeps blocking it. Oh, yeah! Bring it! Oh, he still hit me. Wow! I wish I would have known that before. Hey, thanks, guys, for the charge attack uh, advice. That is super helpful. Okay, now I'm going to get ready, and I'm going to go up here and fight this giant spider. And now I have my charge attack. Oh, yeah! Bring it! Come on!
Yes! <laughs> this is making it so much easier. Uh, somebody, I've seen a couple of people ask if there's any news on the Masses movie. There's not. I haven't heard anything about the development of the He-Man movie. Um, I am still in that camp that I'll believe it <laughs> when I can buy a ticket or when I see some some actual like filming news. But like, uh, man, that movie, I feel like it just keeps getting pushed and pushed and pushed and it's been in development forever. So I have no idea. I'm not sure what it is. This is my second stream. Like watching a stream period or watching me stream? This is the, only the second time I've really streamed in like recent memory uh, okay run right away get him got him okay all right so that fire just got me because i'm an idiot oh good there's this thing i can't attack this sucks come on get out of here come on fight me now Oh, these jumps are awful. Okay. Come on. Come over here. Fight me. I missed him. This guy's tough. He's going to kill me. Ah, get away from him. I like this. The head detection is awful. Like, you have to be right up on the guy. See, like, my sword should be able to reach a little bit further than it does, but it doesn't. Okay. Platforming is not so great in this either, as you guys can probably tell. I don't think I even saw all these before. I missed those last time. Jeez. I'm so worried about getting hit and dying. It's so hard how to, to judge when to hit. All right. Come on, spider. Yeah! Okay, so I'm back over here. Look at that little rock I gotta jump on. That's crazy. Okay. Nice work, He Man! You just found the key to reach Beast Man! I saw him lurking around a clearing at the top of the hill. Oh, yeah. Let's do this. I'll jump back across these tiny little. Okay. Get out of the quicksand! Get out of the quicksand! Watch out, D-Man! Beastman is right across the river at 3 o'clock! <laughs> okay. Let's go fight Beastman. Another giant spider! He was blending in with the sand! I was not paying attention! Okay. Yes, okay. I'm always worried about something jumping out of those now. Okay. Oh! There he is! <laughs> Help! He looks very confused. Okay, I gotta figure out the best way to... There we go. Oh! Oh, I can't move when he does that. Alright, looks like I gotta attack him from the back, just like we did with Clawful. So I gotta get him confused and looking at... Okay. And then he's gonna jump. And I can avoid it by jumping too! Come on. At least this whip looks like it has kind of a short range. I almost messed up. 
I gotta let him turn around. So he goes, huh? Where's He Man? Huh? Where's He Man? I did. Oh man. I don't see him anywhere. This is like an easier fight. I don't want to jinx myself, but this is definitely an easier fight <laughs> than Clawful was. There you go. Oh, he saw me! Yeah! What? Oh, that one hurt me. Run away! Oh! He turned around just in time. How come he can't see me? <laughs> oh no, that got me? Are you serious? Alright, well take that, Beast Man! Ugh. Beast Man didn't stand a chance against your might and cunning! That's right. He-Man's might and cunning. I'm not even going to bother with that. <laughs> oh, I only got 15 out of 20 collectibles. Oh, what does this password mean? Fushimbushish. That's crazy. <laughs> I can see another He-Man crossover possibility. He-Man versus Darth Vader? That'd be crazy. Oh, I've seen a couple of questions about what I think about Ninja Turtles 2012 ending. I'm, I put up a video about that, uh, talking about the new series coming out. Basically, like, I'm sad to see it end because it was my favorite incarnation of the Turtles. But I also feel like it, it at least got to tell its story. And I'm glad it kind of got to, you know, really wrap everything up. It had a great run. Um, I'm glad that it didn't, like, outlive its welcome, too. So that I'm trying to look at the positives of it, but I'm super bummed that it's gone. It's going to be weird um, that the designs are changing again. We're just going to have to get used to a new set of turtles. But I, I love the 2012 Turtle series. Uh, yeah, I saw the meter on the life bar for the charge attack. I saw somebody say that. So I'm not sure how behind these uh, comments are, so I'm sorry if I'm, like, responding to some of these slow ones. Uh, Kapow is if I'm excited about the new Animaniacs. I am... Uh, yes, optimistic. Optimistically excited. I think it's really cool to see that show come back. I love the original. I'll be curious to see how it holds up now. Because, you know, that show is always about, like, current events and pop culture. And I'm really curious to see how they handle that. That's going to be really interesting. This game has decent graphics for a Game Boy Advance game. Love the Connery Stratos. <laughs> if you guys if you guys watched the 2002 He-Man series, that's how Stratos talked. Um, and it was cool because I actually hosted a panel with all the voice actors from this series at the last PowerCon. And I asked, um, I wish I could remember the voice actor's name, but I asked about the Sean Connery voice. And he's, he says it was just kind of a thing that they just did, and it stuck. <laughs> so there was, no, there was no reason behind it. He just did it, and he thought it'd be funny, and that's, that's what stuck. Sorry that you've been yelling at the screen and typing so much. I, I apologize. Like I said, I'm, I, I can't keep up with the comments too much while I'm actually playing the game, so... Favorite variant of He-Man is Thunder Punch He-Man. I love Thunder Punch He-Man. The caps are amazing in that. Uh, why don't you review Lego, says Carlos. I don't know. Um, I think it's because I don't buy a lot of Lego sets anymore because uh, they take up so much space. I think Lego's great, but reviewing them is, I mean, like I have to do all the building and everything, and it's just, it's a lot. <laughs> it's a lot. And I... Uh, I mean, every now and then I still pick up a Lego set that I really like, and I'll do a video on it. But yeah, I, I, mostly I was doing it with like the Turtles Mega Bloks stuff. Uh, I did a lot of those because it was Turtles, and so it was really fun for me to build. I would love to see the He-Man stuff get some building sets. I think that'd be awesome. I would definitely do those. Uh, Motu Bryce wants to know if I have the vintage Wonder Bread He-Man, aka the Savage He-Man. I don't, um, because it. I've always had a hard time wanting to spend money on that because I feel like it's so easy to fake those that I don't even know. We don't even know, like, the solid official origin of that figure, so it makes it hard for me to spend the money on it. Maybe one day. I guess my collection's not really complete without one. Turtles and Injustice 2. I haven't played that yet, but I thought that was a cool crossover. I need to get Injustice 2 because I loved the first Injustice. How many versions of the She-Ra figures do you have so far? Well, I have all of the ones from Classics, and in the Vintage line, I have just regular She-Ra, and I have Starburst She-Ra. So those are all the She-Ra figures I have. Hey, there's a new She-Ra cartoon series coming to Netflix. I'm optimistic about that, too. I'm, I'm curious to see what they do with it. Okay, I'm going to jump back into the game. I got some time, I think, still here. 
Oh, hold on. Let me see. I have a text message from the wife. Everybody say hi to Stina. She's going to see if... Uh, oh, she wants to know if I want some food. Do I want some food? I said, yeah, probably. <laughs> like, is it... <laughs> Um, okay, so let's see. I'm going to let her know we're still still streaming. I had this um, uh, moment where I was I found myself at home without Spencer running around, so that's why I was like, let's do some streaming. Yeah, he's out getting ready. He just celebrated his fourth birthday, and we're having a birthday party for him this weekend, so he's going to be celebrating his birthday, which is pretty cool. Okay, sorry about that, guys. I am going to jump back in. Um, oh, thanks, man. I appreciate that. John just said I'm doing an awesome job. Oh, and thank you for the happy birthdays for Spencer. We appreciate that very much. Okay, here we go. We're going to jump into the next mission. Oh, Manny Faces! Join forces with Manny Faces to help him counter the invasion of the Palace of Eternia. This is pretty cool. Watch out, He-Man! Those laser doors ahead are dangerous. Turn them off before trying to walk through. Um, must be that right there. Okay. Let's see what's in this. Of course. Oh, is that a Shadow Beast? Yeah, we got that Shadow Beasts. That's cool. Ooh, he made quite the screech when he died. Yeah, I got, like, the superpower stuff going on right now. They're they're walking through the lasers. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! I wasn't even barely touching them. Why was that hurting me? Okay, so I turned those off. Oh, okay, I turned these off, too. Let's see if I can go super hit this thing. Yeah. I'm going to avoid the Shadow Beast, because... This is my new strategy. <laughs> yeah! Bring it! Oh, yeah! Okay, so let's see. Where are we going now? Through this door? Nope, can't go through there. Okay. Did I get that? Why can't I get that? What is that? Oh, good. Doomseeker. The most deadly enemies in this whole game. Look at that. I don't even know what that is, but okay. Sorry guys, I stopped talking. I'm like sitting here like really focusing on this gameplay right now. Okay. Oh, I definitely don't want to touch that. Yeah, you stay over there, Shadow Beast. I'm going to wreck your home over here. He-Man, the home wrecker. I mean, I can go through here now? No. Where, oh, okay, the gems are telling me where to go. Going this way, going this way, going this way, going down here. Okay. There's a little bucket down here. Let's see what we got. Ooh, okay. Yeah, what? Bring it! Bring it, green shadow beast! Oh. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my gosh! That was ridiculous! Oh, Disney Dabbers! Do you still do Blind Bag Minifigure Madness? We do, we just don't keep up a pretty good schedule with it. Um, 2018 is a year that we're going to definitely try to bring that back on a regular basis, because a lot of people really like that. Where do you find your rare Shearer figures like Spinnerella and Atasa? I actually don't own either of those. I actually borrowed, was it a Spinnerella from my Classics review to do a comparison time? And I don't think I had an Atasa for comparison time. I don't have those two yet, so uh, maybe one day I'll get them. Uh, can't believe Spencer is four. Happy birthday. I know. I can't either. Thank you, DA. I appreciate that. Uh, hear great sounds from the He-Man show, like, uh, grunt, and so on. Okay, I don't know what that means. 
Alright, here we go. I'm going to try to do this again. Play again. It seems like there's unlimited continues, so at least I've got that going for me. Alright, yep, yep, yep. Don't touch those things. Okay. So we're going to go over here. Um, not go that way. Whoop that dude up. Turn this off. Come up here and break this. Run away from the Shadow Beast. Run away, he man Run away! Oh, yeah. <laughs> I love the noises the Shadow Beast makes when you're hitting him. Wah! 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 One of these had a bad guy in it. I don't remember which one. Probably this one. I think it was that. I think it was this other one down here, so I'm going to skip it. Okay. So let's go this way. Does anybody know what this is? I don't know what this fountain does. It doesn't seem to do anything. It just seems to be in my way. Oh, I got Super Thing. Yeah. Get over here and fight this. Alright, Shadow Beast done. Okay. I'm getting better at the uh, the charge thing, I feel like. Uh, this is definitely one of those games where the more you play it, the better handle you seem to get on it. Because the control... Oh my gosh, that did not have a beast in it last time. The controls are super wonky on this. But it definitely seems like the more you play it, the better of a handle you get on it. Ah! Okay, I remember the green one from last time. Sometimes you hit them and they don't even have, like, energy bar. They just... Okay. Man, that guy takes a lot of health if he hits you. It's easier just to do this on this guy instead of trying to charge up. He's one of the few enemies I've been able to, like, hit repeatedly. Do you notice that? Like, the last three hits, he didn't even have any energy, but it still took three hits to get him. Hey, it's Moss Man's cousin. That's funny. Oh my gosh, the platforming here is not good. Okay, so now I can go back up here. And go this way, probably now. There's a lot of backtracking and stuff. There we go, okay. It's down here. Up here? Good grief! What's the point in opening these pots? Half of the time they have... More than half of the time, they have bad guys in them. It does look like I'm just like... It, like, it looks like there's moss flying off of him while I'm hitting him. Oh, man. Come on. Oh, good. A Doomseeker. Why can he hit me through the wall? Ooh! One hit kill on that Doomseeker if I can get him. That's nice. There's another one of those fountains. Uh, well that one wasn't a one hit kill. Okay, I'm not sure exactly where I'm supposed to be going. This looks like the exit platform. Um, okay, okay, so we got a layer up here to get. <laughs> get away from me, Shadow Beast. Whoa, he can hit me from over there. It's alright, it looks like I hit him too, so that's cool. Okay, man, I'm, I know I said it a bunch. Hit detection is really weird on this. Whoa! Go, 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 go! I gotta wait till that poison warrior's out. Okay. Another... Another green shadow beast.
So you might as well not even swing upwards or downwards because the range is so bad. You have to make sure you line up horizontally to try to hit guys. Okay, it looks like it wants me to go back that way. Oh, what's this? Orko. Bravo, He-Man! Go find King Randor near the metal platform. Okay. Randor's just hanging out in here, huh? Okay, so he was... I guess the platform was this way. Uh, is this the metal platform he's talking about? Where are you, King Randor? Where are you? Oh, there. I guess that's King Randor. <laughs> He-Man, I, King Randor, have been injured. <laughs> he's, he says, I, King Randor, have been injured. While defending the palace, defeat the last Doomseeker to rendezvous with Manny Faces. Good luck. Do I really have to jump over there and hit it? Are you serious? Come to me, dude. Yeah, come on. Bring it. Oh, yeah. Bring it. Oh, come on. One more hit. Come on. Got it. Thanks, He-Man. Right on time. Let's go. Where do I go? This way? Do I go up here to the exit now? Yep. Ha 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 ha! Boosh! <laughs> oh, I thought these beasts feared bright light, not a sharp sword. Well, that's what, that's what He-Man does. I got 15 out of 20 collectibles. That's not bad. I got all the enemies. Okay. Oh, no. Look at that. Look at the artwork here. That's kind of cool. Trapjaw has abducted Queen Marlena. Find him and defeat him. You should play more video games. You're really good. Thank you, Disney Dabbers. I play... I, I love video games. I don't know why I've never really streamed games before. I guess it's because I have a toy channel, so I didn't think people would care about this. But that's why I'm doing a toy-related video game. You can make it work. There's a lot of those. I could play more. Okay. Oh, great. This looks wonderful. All right. Should I go over here? Let's get the man-in-arms thing first. Trap Jaws retreated into the dungeon, taking Queen Marlena hostage. Go save her now. Yes, sir. What are you doing, though? You're just hanging out? Man-in-arms ain't doing anything to help? <laughs> oh, I, that was cool. I don't, what? Okay. <laughs> yeah, I knew that fire was gonna. I was like, I hesitated. Did you see that? What the? He's getting me on the backswing. Ridiculous. Come on. Oh my god. Oh my. <laughs> Who just said I was really good? I'm not that good. There we go. 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 Come on. No! Not not fair. Alright. Should I go down here? Oh, I guess we got... It's probably just going to have another stupid shadow beast in it. Gosh. Nope. Not even going to do it. It's going to leave him down there. Hopefully I didn't have to get him. Can I go? I can't go in here? Oh. That was a scary jump. It was like a leap of faith right there. There we go. Orko! This is a special time skull trigger. After you trip it, the door to the upper floor will open for a short while and then close again. Okay. Here we go. Oh, and I have to deal with fire now? That's great. And Doom Seekers. Wonderful. Well, this is absurd. Are you serious? No, that's not even kind of fair. Wow, did you guys see that? It almost started me down there.
And this is a time thing? I'm gonna have to go back and hit that switch again. There's no way. Come on, man. This is awful. The Doom Seekers are the hardest enemies in this game. Okay, I think I need to go back and hit the switch again. Oh gosh, really? Get out of No! Get out of the way! <laughs> Get him, 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 come on, come on, get him! Yeah! This is crazy! Oh, okay. Okay, so we can go down here now. What's over here? Was that on a timer? Oh. This is another time trigger. I'm not sure what door it opens. I guess you had better find out quick or I'll see you here again. You're a great help, Orko. Thanks. I like how they put enemies in your way for these timed door things. That's super not fair. I guess, I'm sitting here like, it's not fair! <laughs> I guess it's just a challenge, right? It's just, just a difficult challenge. Was it this door that it tried to open? I guess I didn't go fast enough. Have I been this way? Yeah, I did. That's where I came up, right? Okay, I don't want to get trapped down there again. Okay, let's try this again. Oh, good. I mistimed that terribly. All right, so we got to go all the way back over here, hit the switch. Now we're going this way, going up here, waiting for that. It really? Did I not make it again? That's you got to be kidding me. Is that right? Oh, I can run! And I can block. Look at this, guys. I've been playing this how long? I just realized that the right trigger blocks and the left trigger runs. So that's what I'm doing wrong. I gotta run. Oh, oh good. And now I'm gonna be too slow. Go, you let go! <laughs> I just gotta make sure I don't hit that stupid green stuff. Okay. Here we go. Yes! <laughs> I did it! I like how I keep figuring out different things, like, this far into the game. Because the game doesn't explain anything to you. I guess it's one of those games that doesn't really hold your hand, right? You just got to figure it out on your own. Or rely on you guys to tell me. What was that? Oh! Trap <laughs> He's over there shooting at me! <laughs> Well, thanks for the warning, man at arms. I've already been shot by him. Okay. Okay, I gotta figure this guy out. Okay. There's gotta be a. There's, there's been a pattern of all of these guys. I can't sneak a game over. <laughs> you got to read the manual. Get out of here, SEO Tony. Don't tell me how to play games. <laughs> I came into this cold. I wanted a fresh experience with you guys. Come on. When Spencer gets older, he should make a YouTube channel. He'll have lots of subs and should be funny. <laughs> should be a funny good YouTuber when he's 9 or 10. Yeah, maybe. If he wants to go that route, I'll let him. I'll just make sure... I'll make sure it's good. <laughs> I'll make sure it's good quality content. 
So am I doing this level again, guys? You want me to keep going? Pots are all random. That's good to know, Dustin. Thanks. I've, I was definitely figuring that out because it's just you never know what's inside of them. Thank you for the support, Caden. I appreciate you thinking that I can do this, that I can make it happen. <laughs> Um, on the back of the DVD covers for the 2000X He-Man cartoons, it says it won an Emmy Award. What did it win an Emmy for? Is this a trivia question? I don't actually know the answer to this. That's that's cool, though, that it won an Emmy. I'll have to look that up sometime. Okay. What do I think of the game, Charlie Reed says? You know, it's not so bad. I'm having fun. I'm definitely having fun playing and having you guys watch. Um... It's got its issues, that's for sure. It's definitely got its issues. All right. Let's try this all over again. Yep, yep, trap jaw, we know. Okay. Well, I should have waited. Oh, well, my power hit didn't really do much damage to him this time. All right, I missed him. Come on, just die already. Jeez. Okay. Last time that one had an enemy in it. I don't know if it will again. I just don't want to hit it. Oh, yeah. i got to go this way first. That stupid Doom Seeker is going to pop up here. What? <laughs> Another Doom Seeker? I just I should just stop hitting those things completely. Seriously. Well, I whooped that one. Okay. So we got fire down here. We got a dumb Doom Seeker up here. Which is just re oh, these are just the worst. Come on. I really, 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 really hate fighting these things, guys. I really... This is not fun for me. <laughs> this is obnoxious. Come on, I had him. Okay. <sighs> Wait for the fire. Ooh, I almost missed that. Go, 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 He-Man. Go up there. Oh, no. This dumb. I'm going to have to go hit that switch again. Okay, so... Oh! I didn't have to hit that switch again? Okay. I thought that was a timed switch. These shadow beasts take a lot of damage. <laughs> okay, so that, okay. So here we go with this again. Gotta go over here. I'm gonna hit this. And then we're gonna race. Now we're gonna fight these guys first. And then, and then I'll come back and hit the switch and race. Because these are just all going to be in my way, and they're just going to give me damage. Oh, yeah, there we go. Super power punches. Okay. So let's go back. I got another one of those. Let's go back and hit this switch. Okay, here we go. I'm human! Yeah! Okay. Got to get this guy now. Sorry, guys. I'm, like, super focusing because I'm trying to get back to where I was. 
All right. So now we are going to go and fight uh, uh, Trap Job. Gonna go fight Trap Job. Trying to figure out if my comments are a little bit behind. I don't think so, though. I don't think so. What is your favorite episode of He-Man? You know what? I'm really bad at the titles. I don't. I don't think I could give you a favorite episode off the top of my head. Are you talking about from like the 2002 series or like the original series? In the 2002 series, since we're playing that game, we'll talk about that. I think one of the f most fun things they did was they did like the Council of Evil. Do you remember that? The Council of Evil two-parter? And that's basically where Skeletor joined forces with all of these other villains that were like the non-normal villains of his, like not his minions. So it was like him and Count Marzo and Evil Seed and all these other guys teamed up. And that was a really cool story arc. I liked that a lot. Please use the block button. I keep forgetting about that, John. Thank you. You know, I've always been bad about block buttons in games. Uh, even in, like in Mortal Kombat and Street Fighter and fighting games, I'm like terrible at blocking. I just don't do it. Okay. Let's go over here and try to fight Trap Jaw. However, I'm supposed to do that. Okay, he shoots a bunch. Oh my gosh! And apparently he can just shoot through the walls, so I can't hide. You know what's cool? Like, He-Man getting hit, that actually sounds like Cam Clark. Which was the voice actor for He-Man. This is... Kind of ridiculous. Okay, so shoot, shoot, shoot. Attack. Nope. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Okay, shoot, shoot, shoot. Attack. How do I hit him? Come over here and fight me. Ah! Oh! This is the dumbest thing ever. <laughs> oh, John Hall says, when are you going to do a new toy hunt video? Uh, I've actually got one filmed that I have to edit still. So hopefully I can get that edited soon. And I'll get it online. I got, I got a lot of stuff I need to, to get working on. So I want to get back to it. And then I'm hoping uh, as we get going in the year here, I can start doing a lot of trips. Did some. I want to go check out a bunch of different toy shops and stuff and do some more toy hunting videos. So I think it would be a lot of fun to do that. <laughs> oh, okay. That's awesome. Thank you, guys. Oh, all right, comic book guy. The game's funny. All the grunts. Yeah, you're right. That's hilarious, man. These. Oh, this is rough. What time we got? How long have we been streaming? We're at an hour and a half, and I'm at Trap Jaw. I wonder if the book tells me. Okay, so it's Trap Jaw. Oh, then Triclops, then Skeletor, huh? Oh no, Merman's in here somewhere too. Because I haven't fought Merman yet. The bosses are listed out of order in here. So I beat Clawful, I beat Beast Man. I'm at Trap Jaw. We still have Merman, Triclops, and then Skeletor after this. Jeez. Okay. Well, I'm going to go for a little bit longer. <laughs> uh, oh, somebody says they believe they made an Intellivision one. They did. I actually did a video on the Intellivision He-Man game a long time ago, but you should check it out because I actually am really proud of that video. It was It's one of my ones from like probably four years ago or so now, but I, I really love doing that. I thought it was fun. Okay, yeah, these comments do seem like they're coming through, like there's some older ones coming through, so I apologize. I'm looking at the comments on my, um, not directly on YouTube, but on my uh, streaming platform here, so some of them might be lagging a little bit, so I apologize, guys. Let me clip over here, check some stuff out. Sorry, guys. I'm just reading some stuff here real quick. Some people are really upset I'm not using the block button. I'm sorry. I should totally be using the block button. 
Oh, SEO Toy Review says I found codes if you want to skip to the end. Do you guys want me to do that? Do you guys want me to skip to the end and we can try to fight Skeletor? I want to play through this game all the way sometime, but I don't know. I'm actually probably not going to be on here much longer because I think I'm actually going to get some food here pretty soon. I'm getting hungry. I haven't eaten yet, and it's 9 o'clock. So at my time, it's 9 o'clock. I'm starving. Okay. Okay, okay. Everybody's saying yes. Uh, give me a code, SEO Toy Review. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and just skip to the end here. This is a cool game, somebody says. Wow, everybody wants me to skip. I guess you guys are tired of watching me lose to Trapjaw. Oh, okay, hold on. Oh, oh, I hope that doesn't go away too fast. Okay, password. W. R. This is, where's my K? I can't spell. W R K L K D M G. Mission 13, rescue Tila. That darn Tila got captured. Goodness. I always love that picture of Skeletor on the throne of Panthor. Your quest for Tila has finally taken you to Skeletor's inner sanctum. This is the final showdown. Oh. Oh. Okay, here we go. Figure out where I'm supposed to go. Do I have like a whole level I have to do here too? Or do I get to just fight Skeletor? Oh, there he is! Run, He-Man! Oh, man, his shots burn me, so I can't hit any... Okay, where'd he go? Oh, my gosh, that's actually Brian Dobson's Skeletor laugh. That's amazing. Right, oh. How do you... He's got both of the swords like the toy. That's awesome. I guess he used those in the cartoon too, but still. That's great. How do I hit him? Oh, he teleported. I have not hit him once. How do I do this? Oh, yeah! Oh, what? He's got me trapped. Oh! This is awful. Okay. <laughs> There's no way this is going to work. His, his, it, he takes so much more health than me. Okay, get out of there. Get out of there, He-Man. Got my health back. I got to save that next time for when I'm a little closer. Oh, gosh. The stupid fire on the ground. Tila's in there. Tila, I'm going to get you out. I hope. <laughs> okay, this is bonkers. Where'd he go? He's like teleporting. Like, for real, I cannot figure out what I'm supposed to do. Block button didn't block that. Let this be our final battle. I had to throw that movie line in there. What in the crap? <laughs> oh my gosh. I think I'm just going to have to like keep doing this until I hit him. It sucks though because it doesn't take much damage away from him. Oh. 
Man, he hits me way more. No! No! <laughs> I don't know, guys. You think I could do this? Uh, somebody asked if you could ride Battle Cat. Yeah, we had a Battle Cat riding level. Like, level 3 was like a Battle Cat riding level. It was pretty neat. Okay, this there's got to be like a strategy that I'm just not seeing. I love the laugh. I hate the fire on the ground. Okay, stop. Get... Look, I can't even hit the black button. He's, like, bouncing me around. Okay, got that. Oh, yeah, there you go. I got him good there. Yeah! I gotta find him again. Let me find him again. I think that was pretty good. I need to get him in an area where I've got room to run around. Which is not probably up here. Come back down here, dude. Come find me down here. Where did he go? Come on, Skeletor! Fight me like a man. Like a bone-faced... Oh, jeez. I hate how the shots can go... Man, he filled his health back up? Oh, that is super not fair. Come on, get him! I think he can take the energy things just like I can. That sucks. <laughs> I'm gonna get him so that he can't. Jeez, okay, get up here, man, come on. Okay, that's ridiculous. The power hit is just not working. I cannot I cannot get him with it. Dang it! Get up! Come on! Do I have more lives? Okay. Oh yeah! I got him good there. Oh yes! Oh no! He just refilled his health! Oh jeez! I didn't know those things would come back! 
Oh, he has full health again! I, I was getting him too! Oh, jeez. I don't think it's gonna happen, guys. I, I'm running out of time here, too. Oh. I am sorry! I failed you all, and I just got a notification that my food is here. So unfortunately, I think this means the end of the stream. I'm sorry I didn't go out with, like, a big victory. But... This was a lot of fun, and maybe I will do this again. Did you guys please use the block button? I'm sorry, John Hall. I'm terrible at running around and trying to use the block button. But, um, hey, guys, thank you very much for joining me. I'm going to go ahead and get out of here for the night. I really hope you enjoyed this, because I might come back and do this again some night. Maybe we can finish this. But there's a bunch of other He-Man games that I really want to play, and uh, I would love to play them with you. There's some, like, some old Commodore 64 ones and stuff. So we'll have to do this again soon. The rest of you, uh, I hope you enjoyed it. All of you guys, thank you so much for joining me. Enjoy the rest of your Friday evening. Have a wonderful weekend, and I will talk to you all soon. Let me get this ready to click off. Until next time, my friends, have a good weekend.